Hmm. Okay. I think we got this. Okay or not? Oh, bugger it. Unless I can get up one of these lots, I'm just going to... Oh, who am I kidding? Both now I'm going to try at least once more. And... Actually, I wonder if I can jump straight onto the transport, maybe. Would that work? Go! No, because Kyle won't pissing jump when you tell him to. No nuts to it, let's just go. This is the first part of the game. Thus far, it really is going to piss me off. Anything over here at all? Hmm. That's just the main area, isn't it? Nothing to see there. Okay, okay, okay. I can do this, I can do this. I'm operating half from memory, half from intuition, so... In theory, I should be able to do this pretty easily. In theory. Um, any switches I can push? Doesn't seem to be. Any in the tram station area I can push? Nope, still doesn't seem to be. Nuts. I suppose I can't run along there, can I? Because it seems to be electrified. Um, it'll come back to me. It'll come back to me, I promise. At some point, maybe. Yes, maybe yes. Yes, maybe no. Maybe in a minute. Maybe by the afternoon. Maybe by the morning. Or maybe not at all. Not a random dude appears. Out of nowhere. That makes sense, doesn't it? Checkpoint. Ah, I'm going the right way now. Hi guys, how's it going? Don't any of you mind me. I'm just, you know, passing through. Oh crap. Don't take me down. Down to Funky Town. Ah, crap. Damn it, that hurts. Let's see why you guys don't like me lasering you. Bloody hurts. Oh, crap again. Come on, die already. Shit, I'm like, I've got no shield and only four points of health. That's not good. Okay, before I go into there then, let's go and open this supply crate. Hopefully there'll be either Bacter or a shield thing in here. And that, Bacter it is. That works. That's just enough health to survive two, maybe three hits. We should do it just fine, I think. I'm slightly glad I didn't play this on one of the hard modes now. Hate to think what would happen if I had. Hmm. Shield recharge. That could be useful. Nothing out there, from the luck of it anyway. Charge up the old shield. Okay, we're not going to die any time in the immediate future. Oh, back to canisters. Make use of those. We've got good health, decent shields. Yeah, I think we're good to go. Oh, in case none of you realised, yes, I can switch to third person mode like this. It's all very fun. I don't use it very often, except when I'm going to have to do a very tricky bit of puzzle platforming, which I'm remembering this correctly. I'm going to have to do. So I think, I can't remember exactly, but I think I have to hop over here, jump out of here real quick. Oh crap. And yeah, basically be standing on this little lip on the outside after the door, assuming they actually ever bother to actually close. Okay, there we go, that's better. Basically, I'm standing here, ready and waiting, and my phone's going off again. <laughs> ready and waiting for the transport to come through. So I'm now in the perfect position to leap atop it the moment it does. Like so! Aha! Wow. He must have Jedi reflexes to leap atop boxes like this. That's right. Don't catch me doing no pod racing. No siree. Risking life and limb jumping atop dangerous mining equipment. 
Ah, success. Right, back to first person again now, I think. I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, me too. It comes from these little gits. Piss off. hate these things. Literally, they're only here to pad out this section of the game. There's about, what, two minutes worth of tunnels here? You could just run straight through them. But if you have to keep stopping every couple of hundred feet to, you know, clear out the local parasite infestation, it tends to drag things out a little. Oh god damn it, there's more of you. Go away! Leave me alone, you irritating little... Seriously, I don't know what the hell you are. Like a cross between rats and the flood from Halo. You're the Rudd. That's it, the Rudd. God damn it. Make use of my light amplification goggles. See my way around easier. Unfortunately, it does make it harder to keep track of everything else, because I can't see my ammo counter or my health counter like this. Kind of a bitch, but there it is, I suppose. Oh, for God's sake. There you go, yes. So this is pretty much the only reason this segment of the game irritates me so much. Literally, just dealing with these little assholes. They won't go away. Hmm, which way do I go now? This way, maybe? Um, this way? Slave, it's a machine, dude. I suppose that's a whole another argument, but still, you know, it is quite literally just a machine at this point, dude. If we, oh, I suppose there was the corpse, wasn't there? Perhaps that's what you were talking about. Oh well, never mind then. <laughs> really? You think? Piece of mining equipment comes crashing through the ceiling, and they're like, "Hmm, well, that was weird." Perhaps someone should go check it out. I'm gonna kill all the dudes from up here in my safe vantage point before I go down. Make things easy on myself. Is there anything else here in the mines that I need to know about? I honestly can't remember. Have a very, very quick investigate. Mm, doesn't seem to be anything. Hmm. Hmm, I guess not. This one, right, this will just lead me back round to the... Oh, battery, that's useful. Crap, more of you. Little bastards, go away. Shoo, shoo. Bloody rud. Go away. Yeah, I'm just back at the entrance now, aren't I? Okay. Nothing here to be seen. Get on with it. Now we'll consider cutting that, well, this little trek out. But, you know, this is supposed to be a let's play rather than a walkthrough, so... Who cares, really? I won't have the patience to do walkthroughs. To do a proper walkthrough, you'd have to play each level of the game at least two or three times to make sure you had, you know, each segment memorised before you did anything. It just gets so irritating eventually, wouldn't it? Though, you know, more power to you if you have the patience of that sort of thing. That's the bloke whose walkthroughs I sometimes watch. He goes by the name of Smack Reborn. Uh, he usually plays through games on, you know, extreme hard mode and all that kind of thing. Just for shits and giggles, I presume. And, uh, yeah. I mean, it's pretty damn good. I mean, it would be interesting to see what would happen if he added, like, you know, a post-commentary track or some such. I don't know, maybe that would ruin the experience for some people. There are occasions where, if the player is sufficiently good, it is nice just to watch them running around, I do admit. In my case, I'm good, but I'm not quite good enough that I am... I believe I could entertain you all without, you know, my wonderful voice. Adding that little bit of extra touch of a... Uh, Sophistication and verbiosity. Perspicacity, maybe? You can choose your own suitable words. No. 
I'm stuck behind a crate. That's not good. Okay, there we go. Freedom! Bloody crates. Dooby 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 doo. Anything through here? Apparently a dude. Anything other than a dude, though? Nobody! See, I'm running out of commentary now. Not really much to say. Plus, I could try and keep things vaguely Star Wars related. I mean, I've mentioned the EU books every now and again, in which Karkatan does nowadays at least play a small part. Well, not so small. It'll take far too long to explain. Point is, I've uh, I've been reading after a pretty long gap. Anyway, I started reading the books again, and. Uh, yeah, I'm currently waiting to get my hands on the latest novel to come out, uh, Vortex, part of the Fate of the Jedi series. Yeah, I'm quite enjoying it. You can sort of see if you, well, if you've read the stuff, how they've progressed away from the traditional Star Wars mythos and how things are changing and progressing to incorporate new ideas and concepts and storytelling techniques. I think it's all pretty interesting. Holy crap, 100% health and 100% shield? When was the last time we saw that? Oh. No! Alright, take care of you real quick. That's one of you down. Don't you dare make a mark on my beautiful 100% shield. Don't any of you dare. Oh. I have no idea why I made that noise, to be quite honest with you. Probably strange, wasn't it? Damn it, I can't hit that guy. Balls. Well, I'll take out this guy instead, I guess. Boom. Right. Who's next? You next, I guess? Oh, I took care of the commander. <laughs> I love this. Just randomly do backflips. It's like. And again, straight onto the pile. Can I get the other guy as well? And again! <laughs> Creating like a little corpse pile here, it's great. He's really gonna confuse whoever has to come in and investigate afterwards. It's like, holy crap, there's like a small pile of corpses over there. It's kinda weird. Is that your official report? Yeah, it says it is. See, I've ticked the box here. Kinda weird. Alright. So you have. It's a marvellous and interesting thing. Do I push this button? I guess I do. But what did I do by pushing the button? My Mothma was right, Jan. Remnant troops are crawling all over this place and they've taken prisoners. Well, that should bring the Republic running. I'll alert the fleet and pick you up. Go ahead and call in the reinforcements, but I've got a mind to blow up and prisoners to rescue. Oh, Kyle, you're such a hero. Be ready for a quick pickup. Got a feeling that things are going to get pretty nasty around here. Who needs the Valley of the Jedi when you're already gifted with such amazing intuitive powers? Just be ready to pick me up. God, yes, Mum. Calm down, Kyle. That was kind of hot, but... It's a good job explosions in these old games are so self-contained, isn't it, really? Well, that could have been dangerous. Hmm, what's in here? And that alarm's going to really get irritating if it keeps going. Yeah. That didn't occur to me, love, did it? Just get out of there, you say? Where'd you come from? No, seriously. I've wiped out like every dude in this area six times over. Where did you come from? Hey, stop that. This isn't... Stop it. This is not bloody duck hunt. Stay still. Can you really say, show me some ID as you're attempting to gun me down? No, I suppose. They are clones, they're a bit stupid. Only so many times you can replicate the master copy before things start to degrade, isn't there? You know, the first guy's like, stop right there, Rebel's gone. Second guy's like, stop right there, Rebel's gone. Third guy's like, stop. I, uh, by the time you get to like the fifth or sixth guy, he's like, derp de derp de derp. 
doing amazing flying spins to his death like that guy did. Right through the door. Seriously, why on earth would I actually show you my ID in this or any other situation? Think it through, boys, seriously. Where are you going? Are you trying to show off your dancing skills or something there? That was kind of weird. I got them in the mood for dancing, romancing. What the hell am I singing, Abba? That makes no sense. Get away from me, you little freak. Oh, hi there. Retreat. 